So if you've ever found yourself guessing if you should buy something you absolutely love, it's too heavy and you don't think you can hang it, you're in the right spot. So to get today's mirror up, we're going to be using toggle bolts and they have spring action wings that open up behind the drywall and hold up to 70 pounds each. So depending on what you're hanging, now is when you're going to mark your spot. I found the center of my wall and the three holes that were three inches apart, made sure that they were level, marked them, and pre-drilled them. You might need help with the second part. I actually didn't film it because there was a couple guys that were doing another part of the reno in this home, uh, and I actually forgot to ask them if they could be in my video. So they helped me position the mirror. So you're going to put your screw into the hole of whatever it is that you're hanging first before you put it up. Put your spring action bit onto the end of it and screw on. It'll end up looking just like this so that when you close the hangers, you pop them into the pre-drilled holes that are in your wall and they'll open back up. So like I said, I didn't get the permission of the people who actually helped me get it onto the wall, but those two holes, what you see there is where I squeezed the spring action wings and inset them into the wall. Now you're going to see me drilling them so they will tighten up close to the wall and each of them will hold 70 pounds. Was lucky enough that the top hole actually was on a stud so make sure that you check that first because if you do have that you won't need to pre-drill for your third one so you don't need to be scared when you find the perfect mirror that weighs 50 pounds or a beautiful solid wood shelf you can now hang anything up in your space just on drywall 